This is Max Sat again with you, uh, Kazakh Conversation Lesson. Uh, one of those comments were requested for me um, so that I would talk a little bit about Kazakhstan, I guess, or culture, or traditions. Um, you know, of course you can Google it, you know, all this uh, culture, you know, everything about Kazakhstan. But from, yeah, but I, wouldn't, uh, I would like to respond to your request and tell a little bit about Kazakhstan, okay? Um, I was born and raised in Kazakhstan and uh, I really love my country and I'm really uh, you know, proud of that I was born there and I grew up there as well. Um, we, the Kazakhstan is a very diverse country. We have more than 130 nation, 31 nationalities um, and uh, unique, I've traveled a lot and I, I've, uh, I've seen, uh, I've, I've compared Kazakhstan to other countries and uh, one of the unique uh, things which would stand out is uh, that the hospitality is one very, uh, very, you know, the toppest thing I would, I would say. And people are really nice there. Uh, people are really polite. Um, you know, the most of the case, obviously, you know, there's bad people and good people and everywhere. But uh, yeah, the people are very nice. We have a really, uh, we respect elderly people. Uh, we, we are very uh, polite to them. And uh, for instance, as well as I am sure everywhere, but we usually give seats when it's public transportations and uh, uh, you know when we never speak sin like the you right you is a sin uh, is but that we speak speak like you is sis for elderly people or formally sis uh, sis is like uh, you know formal way of saying uh, sis and uh, also. Uh, Sin we say to our friends, to the, the people of our age, and you know, yes, as we always say. Um, also, the Kazakhstan is the ninth largest country in the world, um, number one in exporting uranium, and also now I believe it's the number of the top four countries, uh, oil producing countries, yeah. And uh, the main city is Almaty, uh, it's a population of over, almost of two million people, and the capital is Astana. Astana, I think it, it, it was, um, they moved, this, it used to be Almaty before, but now it's Astana, they used to, they moved the capital like about 11, 10 years ago, I think, I believe, yeah. So you can find out all this information in Google, you know, all this internet things that's uh, available there. Um, what I would like also to mention about Kazakhstan is uh, that we respect other nationalities within, uh, who live within our boundaries of country and also other people. Uh, we are very tolerant to all the um, religions. We don't have official religion. It's a democratic republic, and that is why we don't. And uh, uh, we're tolerant and respectful to all of the other nationalities. The second biggest nationality in Kazakhstan is a Russian. The Russian language is very spoken in Kazakhstan, but with the time, it, uh, I believe that the strategy of uh, learning, uh, you know, the teaching Kazakh uh, lessons is increasing. Um, also, what it, what what also is that that uh, people start learning Kazakh lately more, and uh, that is why I'm making this video uh, to help people to learn this Kazakh language. I, I I know that this language is very beautiful, and whenever I speak, I uh, I, I really enjoy it. So, if you if you want to learn this language and this culture and uh, you may want to visit Kazakhstan, and uh, it's a really good country with a big potential and a bright future. Um, I'm really glad to be part of it, and uh, and uh, please continue watching my videos, and I hope it will be helpful and beneficial for you. And if you have any questions or suggestions, I'm, I've, as I've mentioned earlier, that I'm open for the suggestions and uh, advices. Uh, I'm not perfect in this, and I'm not professional, but I'm trying my best to uh, present my videos for you. Thank you very much and have a good day. Sao Wellness.